Hi guys, Rob 46 here, working myself back to MotoGP24 on the Xbox Series X. Let's continue with career mode. We are coming off the back of a really good Assen. We won a sprint race and we got second in the main race. And now we're going to Satsum Ring, where will our Yamaha come into its own around Satsum Ring? It's not a power circuit. It's a tight, niggly circuit, which isn't really suitable for the MotoGP category. Um... Still running 120% difficulty. So, we're going to go raise the level, beat Mar Marquez in qualifying. So, that's. I'm not going to be able to do the qualifying session. Although, uh, um, Asin, I did. I don't think I'll be able to do that at, um, at Sansom Ring. We'll see. Oh, yeah, the main race is going to start off wet, but dry out. Okay. Let's go qualify. Right, let's head out and qualify and see what we can do. My teammate runs behind me. I don't think we're going to beat Mark around here. We're probably not going to get through to Q2. I'll do my best, but... I just don't think we will. Completely cocked up turn one. Let's take off rings behind me. Nineteen point six. See if we can improve a little bit. Not doing that, we won't. Going all over the curb. No. <laughs> Okay, we try again. We have actually got the fastest lap at the moment, but that will come down, I'm sure. I mean, there's still a way to go, obviously. There we go. Eighteen nine for more Bedelli. You're having a laugh, aren't you? Yeah, we're definitely not going to get into the eighteens. validated that anyway. Would have done it there as well. Uh, 
Okay, we'll try again. Eighteen eight for Miller. Already improve all that. Oh, I've got to be able to improve a little bit. Nah, it's not working. So I've just made my gears a bit shorter. See if that helps, but this is not looking good. Currently sitting in 19th place. Definitely not going to help. It's going to be my last attempt. I haven't really got off to a great start this lap, but. Eighteen point six for Morbidelli. Absolute crap. That concludes the first the wheelies are not helping. Olivera didn't set a time. The who took the last two available a whole one second off. Alright. Soft, soft. Just over half tank of fuel. Let's go. This is not going to be good. It's not going to be pleasant. Here we go. A 
to sneak through on the inside curb. Oh, excuse me. I'm just gonna scoot you on through here. I see Mark right there, but he's probably gonna pull away now. To put traction control up to three as well, we're losing a lot of grip already. Oh, it's never a good thing to happen. Oh yeah, I'm just turn. track really was not built for MotoGP bikes. Acosta's leading at the moment, he's on the fastest lap of the 18.7. Maybe he pulls that up. I'll just get the track limits warning or not. Spinning up on the left a bit more.
No, it's another lap. Alright, Yamaha, stop bloody wheeling everywhere. They are miles ahead now. Oh. <sighs> no points for me in the sprint race. Oh. I'll probably get a long lap penalty or something for that. Long lap penalty, yeah. This is all gone horribly wrong. We're not going to be able to do the long lap penalty. Absolute crap. Absolute crap. As the riders do their cool down laps, let's yeah, they were in the 18s. 19.6. Not good. The uh, main race isn't going to be any better because it's going to be raining. Yay. So, stick with the softs. It's meant to stop and dry out there, I think. There we go. Oh. It's Binder, there's Mark there. That was a nice little move on Mark. Right there through the Saxon curve. And very wide. With the final corner. Uh, 
Nein. If I can hold a line in the dry, I sure as hell ain't going to be able to hold a line in the wet. Just wobbling around at the moment. Definitely didn't want to do that. Oh! Twenty six nine, really. Oh, wow. How do I trap Lemmy's warnings for a crash? me Oh, wow. Okay. Uh. It's going to be one of them. Front does not want to play ball. You can see the bike just wobbling when I'm blown over. I'm not going to score any points in this round. We definitely don't want any more wet races this season, please. And the weather is starting to stop raining a bit. This is definitely going to probably be my worst race of the season. Absolute atrocious. 
I think it's actually stopped raining now. So it's probably going to start to dry out a bit. Map in two. See if that gives us a bit more grip. The uh, track is definitely starting to uh, dry out. Now, do I try and gamble? Do I come in before everyone else does? Or do I just think, sod it, I'll try and stay out on wet tyres which are definitely going to overheat. Because there's not a huge amount of laps left. Well, the white flag is out now. So we could potentially come in and change bikes. I mean, to be honest, I've literally got nothing to lose as it stands. A few people are in changing. Okay, so we are going to be ahead of a few people, because whether or not it's actually the right time to come in now, because we're still getting quicker and quicker even with the wet tyres. And the longer they leave it, we are moving around a hell of a lot, and it is starting to overheat. Oh, Marini's just crashed.
Okay, a lot of people are in. Nakagami is actually leading the way. I'm staying out. The front is okay, it's the rear that is overheating at the moment. So 7.7 .7 behind at the moment, the gap. If I manage to get some points by staying out on the wet tyres, that would be mad. Okay, the front is starting to overheat now as well. Alex Marquez has just crashed. I now lead. Too much through there. We are being caught quite rapidly by Jorge Martin behind. After the gamble, we've got one more lap after this. It's not going to pay off, but. Gone rain again, I dare ya. Be mad if it did, but I don't think it will. I can hear the KTM arriving. Guys, oh, 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 dear, oh, dear, oh, dear. Okay, well, that didn't go to plan. Oh, front nearly went then. Oh. If it was one lap less, we would have been alright. Oh, someone's gone down there. I think that was Binder. Well... I still finished higher than I would have done if I'd carried on and pitted. Still gotten the points, 11th. Let's take a quick look at the final MotoGP standings. Okay, didn't beat Mark though. Okay, well we definitely scored more points, like I said, than we would have done. So, still 80 behind. Still second in the championship, so not complete disaster. Dropped down a third in the constructors though. But yeah, that was horrible, even in the dry. We were nowhere near their pace. We've lost some reputation. Fine. 
Silverstone. Ah, oh, wet main race. Why? Why are you starting to give me wet races now? Just as we start getting into our stride. Okay. So, and then messages. There's more than one fault, but is what it is. Right. Overall standing, some of them. Moto 3, Luca Lanetta still leads away from Yamanaka in second. Holgado third. Vaya moves up to fourth and Furusato up to fifth. Moto 2, Mazia still leads away from Sasaki in second. Ramirez is up two positions to third. Aji down to fourth and Gonzalez down to fifth. And Moto GP, Bagnaia still leads away from myself in second. Jorge Martin third. Vinales fourth and Bastianini in fifth. Anyway guys, that is it from me. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to leave this video a like if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to the channel for more content. I'll see you guys next time, where it's probably going to be another atrocious round. See you!